Hi, Leanne Christie here again. I just want to thank you so much for coming this morning and I hope you've gone away as inspired as I have. I have one of my mates in the room, Max Hitchens, the hospitality doctor, who's always got my back. He brought a video with him this morning so we could get a quick goodbye and a few more thoughts on hospitality at events from Keith Ferrazzi. And here it is for you as a little extra. Keith, your book uh, talks about candour. Uh, how, tell us how we can use candor in the hospitality industry. All of our research has shown that the number one debilitative element of business today is conflict avoidance. In a sense, it's a lack of candor. If you've ever sat there in a meeting and somebody has been going on and on and on, and you know that the people in the meeting are holding back what they're actually thinking and the real conversation doesn't happen until after the meeting's over and maybe it's happening in the hallway, that's, that's obscene. Imagine if we could be in a business environment where people proudly and with their own authority can actually speak their minds. Imagine if the number of projects and initiatives, if they actually could hear all of the inputs candidly and courageously, imagine how quickly and productive things would be in the business environment. The first thing that has to begin to occur is that the leader has to set the tone in the environment and ask people for feedback. Feedback is something that we shy away from hearing. Feedback is something that we shy away from giving. We've got to recognize that feedback and candor is just data. Just because I give it to you doesn't mean you have to do anything with it. So recognize, one of the things I would suggest, if you're sitting in a room and the leader isn't giving that kind of permission, here's the way I might give my feedback. Um, you know, I, I absolutely am so deeply uh, committed to the success of this particular initiative that I feel like if it's acceptable to you, I'd like to share something that maybe, just maybe, will have some impact on the success of your initiative. And, you know, recognize that as I'm giving this advice to you or this thought, um, it may be wrong. You should go check it with some other people and then go ahead and give your piece of advice. The importance of what I just did is I, I first of all, I asked for permission. Do I have permission to be able to be candid? The second thing I did is I let them know that, listen, it's just a piece of advice. Use it, throw it away, do whatever you want to with it, it doesn't matter. I decharged the concern that people have, which is, oh my God, they're giving me advice, I, you know, now I have to argue it and debate it. Just give it to it, gen just give it generously. If they want to re-gift it, they're welcome to. Maybe there's a couple of quick pieces of advice to bring greater candor into your, into your life.